Hi, I'm Roger Goodsell from Cruising Yachts here in Alameda, California. Today we're going to do a little bit of a walkthrough on a beautiful 2013 Jeannot 379 Sun Odyssey. This boat has just become available through our brokerage, so take a look. On this boat we have a very large cockpit. Also we have a dedicated locker for the uh, life raft. We have twin wheels as you can see and we have a uh, a drop-down transom that uh, can be used to enter the dinghy or uh, a nice swimming platform. We also back here have a, a hot and cold freshwater shower available in the cockpit. Over on this side, the starboard side, we have the throttle and we also have the instrumentation which we have Simrad instruments on this boat. We have a uh, chart plotter to, to the which boat. Is sent over on the starboard side we have the autopilot and the not depth and wind speed instrument. We also have the Harkin winch, whereas the main sheet and the jib sheet all feed back here, as it does on the port side uh, to the winch over there. So you can control both of those sails from, from either helm. In the center of the cockpit, we have the Simrad chart plotter, which will swivel to port or starboard, so you can watch it from either helm. We have a very large uh, table in the center of the cockpit which can hold plenty of ice and your drinks in the center. It has storage lockers in the front at the back and both sides come up on this table as you see. So you have lots of room for seating uh, for dining out in the cockpit. Going forward you will find that we have a main halyard electric two-speed Harkin winch uh, which is just perfect for this boat and then a very very nice dodger with uh, ocean rails on the side uh, so you have something to grab on when you're moving forward. All the lines feed aft and under the deck to rope clutches and both all of this can be handled from back here in the cockpit so you don't have to go forward in bad weather. Coming down below we have very wide steps coming down with great handholds, leather wrapped handholds uh, for safety. The engine in this boat is a 29 horse Yenmar sail drive. Very quiet running engine and uh, it has a three bladed flexifold prop on the bottom of the boat for you. The head in this boat has a very nice stainless steel sink, plenty of storage above the sink and below. You have a manual toilet and also a shower stall. Uh, the door opens up. Behind this there is a door that leads into what we call the garage. The garage has access from the head and also from the cockpit area and as you can see it holds an awful lot of stuff. On this vessel we have an aft facing nav station and a very nice hanging locker. We have a VHF radio and a fusion stereo with speakers here in the main cabin and also in the cockpit. Just forward of that we have the uh, control panel for the boat. Forward of the nav station we have a very large settee with plenty of storage behind and a small locker forward of that. On the starboard side we have a very large salon table which has two leafs that open up and we also have a, a conversion unit that allows us to turn into a a double berth if needed and plenty of storage once again up above uh, on the starboard side of the boat. All the way forward you have a very very large v-berth. In this cabin we have uh, plenty of hanging lockers and storage space. That's it. In the galley we have a very nice double stainless steel sink. Next to it we have a very large top loading refrigeration system. Lots of storage in this galley. A little after that we have a nice two burner propane stove with oven and broiler and above that a nice microwave oven. After the galley we have a very nice stateroom. It's a double wide stateroom with plenty of storage and a hanging locker.
we have a uh, traveler forward of the Dodger and then we also have uh, inboard shrouds to make it very easy to go fore and aft on this vessel when you're out at sea. The boat also has adjustable jib car tracks on both sides and this boat has a uh, hard vang and a in-mast furling system with a double spreader on it and then forward we have a furler with a 106 way forward we have a very large anchor locker with chain and road with a electric windlass and also a, uh, a remote to operate the windlass this boat also has a double bow roller and uh, as I said lots of room in the in the anchor locker moving aft a little bit we have a very wide open deck for lounging in the sun when you're on the hook or at, at your slip.